Now I'm going to cut some threads on the screws and I'm going to use this threading box here that I made. I did a video on that, so if you haven't seen it already, then go and check it out. The screws are finished and they're made from camphor laurel. Now I need to make some jaws and I've got this piece of packing pine. I can't remember where it came from, but it's pretty substantial. I think that should do uh, a good job. All I have to do now is put it together and I'll show you uh, exactly what I've done and how it works. So we take this first screw and this is the one that's got a groove on the end of it here. The other um, screw has a groove near the handle end and that will become more apparent as we put it together why that is. So first of all I'll put that through this jaw here and I'll screw that all the way. The end of that screw goes into the opposite jaw and that's just a smooth hole, there's no threads in there and it's a little bit bigger than the uh, end of the screw. It's uh, quite a loose bit so uh, it doesn't get caught up in there. And then if you can see the groove there, we use the collars and they go inside those grooves and that will hold the screw into this jaw here. So I'll put those screws in. So then we take our other screw and we put it through this jaw here and that's a smooth hole again and this one is quite a sloppy fit and screw it into the uh, opposite jaw. And then the same as the other screw here, this has the groove in it but the groove is this end of the screw and then we just uh, install that collar as well, making a meal of that. And that's it, that's put together, and then I can show you how it works. I haven't used a hand screw clamp since high school, and that was a long time ago. I've wanted to make one for a long time, and also I wanted to use my wooden threads for something, so I've finally got round to it and I've made it, and I think it looks fantastic. I'm really, really pleased with it. It works great as well. I'm not sure how much I'll actually use it, but it's cool, and I'm glad I've made it anyway. So, uh, to give you a bit of a demonstration, it uh, adjusts like a conventional uh, hand screw clamp does and it's very smooth and it works well. So as you can see that's good and you may be wondering, uh, wait a minute, let's get that back. You may be wondering how you can adjust it like that when it's got two right hand threaded screws because a conventional uh, hand screw clamp would have two opposing threads, one would be a left hand thread and that's what allows you to adjust it like that. But the reason is, is both holes are threaded in the same jaw, where normally you would uh, 
this screw here would be threaded in the opposite jaw and this one would be threaded in that jaw and if that's the case then one of them has to be an opposing thread but because they go through the same jaw and they're free running in the opposite jaw then you can adjust it like so if that makes any sense I hope that makes sense but anyway you can see it works uh, it's not perfect uh, there's a little bit of chip out here and there but it works perfectly well and I made a mistake here with this hole that wasn't supposed to be a through hole that was supposed to be stopped uh, but I got a bit confused which holes I was drilling and uh, yep yeah, so but not that that matters uh, it might even be a good thing but uh, yeah it's not what I was planning so apart from that I think it's pretty cool so hopefully you enjoyed it if you did please like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one and by the way I'm going to give this one away and I'm going to do that on Instagram so head on over to my Instagram and check that out I've been meaning to do a giveaway for some time but never know quite what to give away so I'm going to do this. It is quite heavy, it's 1.5 kilograms so it'll cost a bit to ship but I'll do that to anywhere in the world so anyway go over and, uh, and check that out. Uh, it will be this one as well, I haven't made another one, I may make a couple more but it'll be this one so you'll have the through hole and the chip outs and all that So, but it works perfectly well and it is pretty nice as it is so check it out.